I'll use it. Said it once, said it twice, say it once again. Dreams only come true. Yeah. Hey guys, what's going on? Kayla Shade here again with Mix in the Crowd, sitting here with Marina City. We're gonna play a little game. We're gonna, I don't know who we wanna call it, who's who, rat out the band member, or... Oh boy. <laughs> Is that like the newlywed show? <laughs> <laughs> We're like... We're a newlywed. Always. <laughs> <laughs> call it like, okay, we'll call it Newlyweds Band Edition. There we go. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna be asking them a series of questions of most likely twos and just maybe a few personality traits. And they're gonna answer of the three guys that are sitting here, which band member is most likely to get caught up in this kind of shenanigans. You guys ready? Okay. Who is most likely to go streaking? Um. <laughs> you got two Rickies and an Aaron. <laughs> well. <laughs> I knew there isn't even hesitation. <laughs> I was actually going to put myself up, too. If anybody wants to know, I am right. You can nominate yourself, by the way. You can I know, nominate but yourself. I was going with Aaron. All right. Who's most likely to need bailed out of jail? Oh, uh, it's probably me again. <laughs> you, all, you were going to grab my name. I was, I was just because I felt bad that I was going to pick on Ricky again. Who's most likely to be kicked out of backstage? Um, Ryan? Because <laughs> <laughs> he typically does get kicked out of backstage. Oh yeah, that's true, because I'm not 21. Oh, yeah, I guess yeah. that would work. <laughs> um, I'm always backstage. I'm, I'm just kind of thinking when I was talking. <laughs> On a boat, who's most likely to get seasick? Probably Aaron. Go there. Go there. Oh, I'm going with Ryan. Yeah, it's either Aaron or Ryan. <laughs> or as I like to call it, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan. Fair enough. Okay. On the road, who's most likely to get homesick? Um, man, I've always wanted to go on the road. I think out of all of us, <laughs> to be honest, it would be none of us, but if anybody, it would be Ryan, probably. Just because, I mean, I've been on the road plenty of times, I love it. Aaron just has the attitude where he loves it, and Ryan does too, so. Is that what you say to Aaron? Ryan? Uh, yeah, Ryan's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it wouldn't be my much, it'd be like, it'd be more probably Matt or Ryan. Yeah. yeah, Matt for sure. Yeah, and remember, this is just like yeah. half of yeah. Marina City. Yeah, so. there's, there's three others. <laughs> Who would be the most likely to get a parking ticket? Uh, probably me. <laughs> so I like to park anywhere. I'm just like, yeah, he does. <laughs> to be honest, I'm just saying, like, I'm more ethical when it comes to parking, and my bandmates are just a little more safe. <laughs> That's why we have his name on there. And so from now on you'd be paying every parking ticket. <laughs> yeah. No, that's cool. We have rules like rule number one. <laughs> don't, don't listen to Ricky. Ricky. Don't listen to Ricky. <laughs> don't listen to Ricky when he goes in directions. When he goes in directions, don't listen to Ricky. Alright, who's the Go biggest on. flirt? Um, we can go with Aaron, dude. Yeah, so this oh, yeah. straight up Aaron, dude. Because, yeah. I mean, we're all taken except for Aaron. So he's <laughs> and Aaron. Aaron. Even though I think... Oh, our I guess I'll just put my name down. Yeah, Aaron, Aaron for sure. We don't really flirt ever, so we hang. we're just friendly guys. So we're friendly. That's cool. that's a good attribute. That's a good trait. <laughs> <laughs> Got organized things. All right, who's the messiest? Oh, I'm pretty clean. So. I don't know. Maybe it's probably me. I think I'm pretty messy. Even though I'm really like organized, it's like organized and chaos. Sure. I'm like an OCD. There's a method to the madness. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, if, again, if the other guys were here. See, this would probably actually be the three cleanest guys. Yeah, I would say so. Brian. Brian is probably the dirtiest guy. <laughs> Brian is garbage next all the time. I appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> Brian is always like just leaving garbage in the yeah. yeah. Same with, I mean, Matt's still in high school, so we'll give him a few years and he'll be cleaner. But I just think that, yeah, Brian's just the most part. So I'm just, <laughs> he's gonna so love sorry. that. I have like those CDs that just keep my stuff together. Like, just, like, uh, but yeah, I guess he's yeah. three probably not. So who's the quietest? Aaron. Aaron is the quietest. Maybe he hasn't even talked. Matt's the quietest. <laughs> he just laughs. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> but no, he does. No, this kid, you think, oh, he's so quiet and so, like, innocent. He's the hilarious. whole time he's talking, he's like, I'm not sure. He's like, he's saying bad things about everyone. No, he's not. <laughs> He is. He's probably the funniest guy. They're just throwing you under the bus. Yeah. <laughs> he just doesn't talk. <laughs> All right. Who's most likely to win a drag competition? Oh, dude, I've won a drag competition. <laughs> really? <laughs> just kidding. 
I was actually going to nominate myself, but I guess if Ricky already has... Dude, you know what? It's going to be a tie between Ryan and Ricky. I mean, I do have... A lot of people think I'm the strict... That'd be the gayest trick that they've ever met. So. <laughs> well, I won this Halloween competition one right, time. Judy, for being a. Uh, okay, okay. This little thing. This, we had, we were acting like Green Day for a concert, uh, for a uh, show, and he had to wear eyeliner. And everyone, well, everyone did because that's what Green Day did. But for whatever reason, he looked like a woman, and we just called him Judy all day. And he was so. Then I washed it off. He was so. Nice and he was and so then mad. I didn't play the show when I went. He didn't even play. Yeah, he actually kicked his bass. That Where's why? He totally played the show. Yeah, yeah I just watched the island. Yeah. Okay, okay. Personal story. Since they did throw you under the bus with that one. In high school as a cheerleader, and for Spirit Week during Halloween, we had to dress up as our boyfriends or a boy or a significant others. One of my really good friends in high school actually hit on me, thought thinking I was a new student. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh my god! I'm okay. Oh, that's, that's just, <laughs> hey, you know, Eric did hit on me. Eric did hit on you. That's Which, right. if anyone knows me, I don't know how that's even remotely possible. <laughs> but <laughs> evidently, I look like a dude sometimes. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Anyway, who's most likely to spend $1 million quickest? Whatever, dude. <laughs> I'm going with Ryan, dude. Do you see how this kid spends money? I'm not going to lie. He spent, like, so much money in the band so far. For the band. Like, for the band, but still. If I think for the band. I'm sorry, but I am a money saver. I just feel like if you were given a million dollars, the first thing. Yeah, but I'd buy, like, a burger joint. Make all the money back. Yeah, I guess so. But I mean, I spent, okay, the reason why I spent a lot of the money is because I'm the one that has the control of the money. So, like, whatever. <laughs> so, yes, I mean, I guess that's. I'm just I saying, I'm a penny to... saver. So, who's the most forgetful? Forgetful? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. So that one seems pretty self explanatory. Uh, <laughs> I'm just going to shoot out of the blue and just go, fine. <laughs> well, you know, I have a lot going on, and my girlfriend would probably agree with that. So, uh, Aaron, I mean, he's not even talking. Aaron, Aaron can't forget because he doesn't see it. Forget you. Forget you. He just shows so, up. Who's most likely to be late for practice? Um, Eric, because he's got the drum set, he's coming from the farthest. Yeah, but I think Brian's always late. Brian's pretty late. late. Yeah. So Brian's no one here. Late. No one here. Actually, Aaron's been pretty late for the last couple of oh, months. Dang. Yeah, Tire marks on you by the time we leave here. <laughs> the new guy. Yeah, okay. So who posts the most photos online? I post a lot of photos of puppies. <laughs> Three little puppies. You gotta put it up or what? Aaron doesn't even okay, go with the suede boat. Yeah. Raren. Raren. <laughs> Raren. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready for this last question? Nope. Most likely to become the first parent. Brian, Brian, dude. Brian. <laughs> Brian's not here, but yes, Brian. Brian. Uh, the only reason why I would say Ricky is because he's the oldest, but I'm Brian is the oldest. Well, well oldest, oldest of here. He's the second oldest. oldest of here, yeah. Yeah, there's no way. I'm just, I'm afraid to even grow up, so there's, <laughs> there's no way. So we got Peter Pan syndrome. Yeah, we got Peter Pan syndrome. Yeah, Peter Pan syndrome, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> I can see that. All right, and the final tally is Eric, who's not here, two. <laughs> Brian, correct? Yeah. One. Aaron with five, and the most likely to cause shenanigans are the combination of Ricky and Brian. Nice. <laughs> so thank you guys for tuning in to our first newlywed band edition, and we'll see you at the show. <laughs> Please stop the music, I swear I might lose it. Gun to my head and I promise I'll use it. Said it once, said it twice, say it once again. Dreams only come true.